Hi, welcome to the G4 Guitar website. Uh, this is the, all about the G4 Guitar method. What I want to do is um, just explain a few things to you. I, I want to cover three things. First of all, I want to talk about what makes the G4 Guitar method so special. Secondly, I'm going to talk about what makes the G4 Guitar method actually work. Um, and thirdly, I want to talk about how you can make the most of this website. Okay, so let's have a look. What, what makes the G4 Guitar Method so special? First of all, we specialize in guitar teaching. Often, uh, to the uninitiated, if someone can play guitar, they assume that they can teach guitar. Um, this, unfortunately, is not quite the reality. I think we all know this. Uh, uh, let me use a quick example. We also, any, hopefully anyone who's, reading, who's watching this video speaks English and reads English and understands English quite well. To teach English is another thing. I would not call myself an English teacher because I don't know the first thing really about grammar or, or, or how to teach English and what the best way to teach English is and what they should learn first and how and why. Um, so w what, I'm, what I would say is that when you're learning guitar, what you need to do is seek out a guitar teacher. You need someone who actually knows the, the art or the craft of teaching or the skill of teaching guitar. So what makes the G4 Guitar Method so special is that it's based on many, many years of research. Over 20 years of research, what we do is we look at all the ways that people learn guitar and learn, and we've looked at all the different strategies, not all of them, but many of them. And what we do is that we, we take the best of those strategies and we improve on them. So what you're basically getting when you do the G4 Guitar Method is you're getting that many, many years of experience. When, not just from our own point of view, but also from the point of view of many other styles of teaching music. And we, we obviously seek out whatever we can, wherever we can from the greatest teachers that we can find. So as a guitar student, if you're going to learn guitar, what I suggest is do it right the first time. Let's, get, let's develop the skills that you need right from the beginning because the, the question that I usually ask people is how long do you plan on playing guitar for? And the general answer is forever, for life. So if you plan on playing guitar for life, you may as well spend the first year or two getting it right. Let me use an example. When you go to a when, when you buy a computer, it, let's say you've never never learned to type, you've gone out and bought your first computer and you want to type an email. Now, the, the thing that most people do is they get on there and they punch away doing what we call hand pecking and they end up doing that for, for the rest of their life. So they, they don't actually develop the skill of typing. So as a result, they're slower, they make more mistakes and it just generally is a, it, 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 generally they're not going to progress as fast or they're not going to be able to do the things they want to do as quick. So let's have a look at from the guitar point of view. I'm going to answer the second question, why the G4 guitar method works. What makes the G4 guitar method work? Well, a couple of things. First of all, the G4 guitar method is based on the seven essential skills of guitar playing. You can have a look at those skills on this website. Without these skills, you're going to find it difficult. You need to develop the skills. If, if we look at the, the, way, the, 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 the objective of any guitar player is to play songs, now, if you just play songs and you don't develop the skills, then you will hit what we call the wall. And that happens to many people. We, we actually get a lot of students, adults, who say, look, I've been playing for, for five years, six years, ten years even, and I don't feel like I've been I've improved at all for, for several years. And the, re the reason is that they're not developing skills. They're simply working on songs all the time. So they may even have a huge repertoire of songs, but they don't play any of them very well, and they, they don't feel like they're advancing beyond that point. So the, the, the second thing is the G4 Guitar Method is a tested and proven program as I've already pointed out. Using a tested and proven program is important because it means that you're, you're, you're not a guinea pig, that you're actually using strategies that, that, that have been proven to work. So it gives you that confidence to know, well, yes, this is something that, that does work, so I just need to stick with it and I will get the results. And that is the case for most people. Um, the G4 Guitar teachers who work with G4 Guitar are all trained, so unlike a lot of teachers, th these teachers have specific training, they go through a, a fairly comprehensive training session, uh, a training period if you like, before they even start teaching with G4, but then they also get ongoing training, so the, the result is that they're always improving as a teacher, but of course the, they, they already are using strategies that work right from the word go, so no matter who you learn with with G4 Guitar, you're going to have someone who has uh, a bag of tricks, if you like, or all the, all the correct strategies to be able to teach you correctly. Um, another thing is the, the G4 Guitar method is a structured method. So by following a structured method in order, it, it, it also gives you that confidence to know that if I follow the steps, I'm going to get the results. 
uh, guitar, G4 Guitar also monitors you. What we do is that we monitor the progress of both students and the teachers. We look at which teachers are getting the results from the students and which students are getting the results. So monitoring is very important. We do this via checklists. We have, in, when you join with G4, you get what we call a checklist. We go through that checklist, we tick, it, tick everything off and make sure that you can do everything that's on that checklist and that means your skills are being developed and means that you're progressing. The uh, one more thing um, is that we provide of because a lot of online information, and that's what this website is all about, providing you with extra information. There'll be sections which which anyone can get to, but there, there are also member sections which are only for G4 Guitar members. Now you can be a member by just joining our membership plan, um, you, or you can sign up as a student. And you automatically become a member. So some people just want to sign on and get the information straight off off the website, and that's fine. You can do that. Um, but if you join as a G4 guitar student then you obviously you get private tuition or group tuition with one of our teachers and also you get access to all that online information so that gives you that hopefully that helps you to understand why the G4 guitar method works basically we we have many many things in place that are going to help you to develop as a guitar player now uh, what I want to do is just take a, a minute just to explain briefly uh, something that just to give you a, a sample of what we do and how we teach. I'm, I'm going to show you if you haven't played guitar before at all this might be a little bit over your head but if you're, if you're not an absolute beginner um, then this, this should make sense to you. This is what we call a chord. Basically what happens is that, that if you put if you play three or more notes at, at any point, that is what we call a chord. Now, most chords for guitar are generally played with three fingers, so one, two, three, like that. Some are two fingers, some are even one finger, but we're just going to look at the three, three finger chord here. Typically, what people do when they learn a chord is they go one, two, three. That's how they learn a chord. Now, if we reverse that and go three, two, one, what that does is it helps us to flatten out the chord. In other words, we, we get the fingers going on all at the same time. That's what we're aiming for because if you can get the fingers to hit down at the same time, you're going to get a quicker reaction time. So your chord changes are going to be faster. So when you're moving between chords, then you're not going one, two, three, chord, one, two, three, chord, one, two, three, chord. You just basically put the fingers down and you can move. Yes, you can see I can instantly get to each chord. So that's what you're aiming for. That's just a sample. We have many, many, uh, many, many strategies, many exercises that we give you to do to develop all these parts of your playing and to speed up the way that you learn. So you learn quickly and efficiently and correctly right from the beginning. Okay, so the last thing I want to touch on here is this website, how to get around the website. It's fairly simple. What I suggest to you is do the tour first, go through the tour. If you have a look at the top of this website, you'll see all the headings. And then what you can do is just select on which heading is appropriate to you. You will also find various links that go to various places on the website. But start with the tour. You'll see down a little bit, bit lower. Um, go through, it'll, it'll, it, I think it says there, what makes the G4 Guitar Method work. If you click on that first and take, go through the, each step, at the bottom of each page, it'll say next. Go to the next page and that'll take you through the, each of the pages of the tour and that'll give you as much information as you will pro probably need at this point. Thank you. Hopefully this has been informative for you. Please feel free to contact me or email me at any time and I'm more than happy to answer any of your questions. Thank you very much. See you later.